You guys, you will not believe what was sent to me. I have never in the history of a PR package ever got an item like this before. A freaking e-bike. You guys, an e-bike. Oh my gosh. Nice. Let me get the scissors and get everything. <laughs> Hey you guys, it's your girl Unique the Iconic and welcome back to my channel. If you have not already, definitely go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so that you can go ahead and stay up to date with my new videos and new posts. With that being said, if you clicked on this video, then you know what it's about to be about. I am like super excited about this video because i finally got a bike i've been wanting a bike for so long thanks to dyu i have an e-bike now when i tell you guys i cannot wait to show y'all this bike i've definitely been trying to do this video for like at least three times so this is the third time you know what they say three times the charm so with that being said i definitely did record some footage when it first got here to show you how it's assembled and to just show you how it looks when it comes in the packaging with that being said um dyu was so kind enough to send me a the 14 inch folding bike it has a 350 watt battery power and it is a rechargeable battery and it is a self-assist bike so which means you don't really have to pedal on the bike so with that being said i don't want to kind of give you all too much of a long intro so i'm definitely going to go ahead and just get to the next part and show y'all the bike i'll be back y'all i got a bike and it's cute too i like your like it's the perfect size for me i'm small and this is the seat we got to put the seat on there and that is where we got to charge it i hope this doesn't take too much electricity Is that the latch? Yeah, right here. Turns around, I believe. They have no instructions in the box, man. Right? Yeah, they have instructions as well. It's just to connect, but it's just something we have to look at. Yeah, later. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because it folds. It's supposed to be, like, portable to put in your car. Mm -hmm. But the reason they sent me this bike, so this bike is supposed to be a city bike. I'm supposed to be able to go over terrains and stuff like that of the city. That's why they sent me this one. So, yeah. Look at her. Okay, you guys. So, this is the bad boy we have here. This is the 14-inch folding bike. And it has a 350-watt battery power. I'm sorry, with 350-watt motor. And it has a two-year warranty. I'm sorry. Oops, step in the water. It has a two-year warranty um, also when it comes when you repurchase the bike. Now, this is the model, the DYU C3 14-inch e-bike. And it is the pedal assist, as you can see here. The motor would typically be like right in here. And also, this is the charging port located there. You can see it. Now, um, this bike does come with the electric lights right here. So can see here and this is like a little rack you can use i'm actually going to get a basket that does not come from dyu but the one that i'm getting from amazon to put here okay so let's cut it on so this is the power button right here and then you'll see the green lights this is fully charged and then what you would do is you would hold this part down for about i believe about 10 seconds or about five five to ten seconds and you'll see the lights will come on so if you're riding at nighttime, and this is the seat. The seat is adjustable to your height. I'm very little. I'm pretty sure you all should know this by now. I'm about four, ten and a half, almost four eleven. So sorry, you guys. My phone, not my phone. My camera died on me. But as I was saying, these are the electric lights that come on when you hold the battery down. And also, this is an adjustable seat. So I'm really short. So I'm about four ten and a half, four eleven, which I'm pretty sure all of you all know. And I got this phone mount off Amazon. This does not come with it. 
So I'm going to turn the lights off because as you can see, it's pretty sunny outside. And yeah, we're going to go ahead and go for a ride. So let's see. One minute, 37 seconds later. Y'all, so my dad is on the bike trying to bring it to the trash. I cannot wait to see how this is about to go. Hold on, let's go over here. <laughs> did you make it? <laughs> let's see if you can bring it back up. Oh, you cruising. You cruising. You cruising, man. Oh, you, you're having a great time, aren't you? He's gone, y'all. He is definitely gone. <laughs> hey, man, listen. We got tacos to get. It's time to get off of the bike. Love it. No. It's no. time to get off of the bike, okay? You're no. acting like a child right now. Get off of the bike. Where are you going? I will run you over with my car. <laughs> Learn to break it down first before you do that. So we're learning to break it down. All right, folding it up, getting it inside of the car. Pretty sure you gotta put the seat down too, probably. And then you just pop it in the car. Look at that. Even though my seat is getting a little dirty, but yeah, all right. Later that same evening. Let's get ready. today <laughs> um but with that being said you guys i mean as you can see with the little mini trip i did around the park with this i can really tell it is a good quality bike i definitely do recommend it i can honestly say though the only cons about it is that um going up the hill it doesn't have enough power to be able to take you up a steep hill so if you're someone who prefers to have a bike that brings you up and down hills then I prefer you get one of the bikes that are made for mountain terrains. The e-bikes they have, we'll put it on their website. This one is more for like the city. It definitely does a good job going over bumps and going over cracks and everything because it's literally like a, a very light little jolt, but it's nothing too strong to knock you off the bike, bike especially for someone my size. Woo! Like, comment, subscribe! 